Hello guys, it's Hazaween here. Today's horror game, Happy Saints called The Moon Has Faded Away, where I play a little boy named Alex who's just moved into his new apartment with his mum and sister, when strange things begin to happen, like the disappearance of the moon. So, if you guys would like to play a game for yourself, I'll leave the link down in the description. In the meantime, let's play the game. August 24, 2 p.m. The new apartment looks spacious, but not as much as the old house. My mother has told my little sister Eleanor and me that this will be the last time, but I'm not so sure about that. It's not the first time we've moved, and I highly doubt it would be the last. Her job constantly forces her to move from city to city. The apartment is on the ninth floor, which allows us to have a view of almost the entire city. Maybe this place isn't so bad after all. I guess this is me writing my little diary or journal. So we've moved a lot, I suppose. Must be hard trying to make friends as well. Okay. I have to look for mum and dad. It's the room at the end of the hall. Okay. Okay, we're in. Jesus. Heavy winds today. Is that my duvet cover? Interesting. So, I have to look for my mum and sister. That's my backpack, I see. Or someone's. Wow. We're high up. You could almost touch the sky. <laughs> All right. Anyways, let's go find mom and sis. What's this? Can't turn it on, whatever. Oh! Why is there a drain by the toilet? Does one of us have IBS? And the curtain to the shower <laughs> all right hello sister sisters she's painting all right I'm gonna assume mom is in here hello mom Maybe Eleanor knows where she is. Hmm. Eleanor. Hey Eleanor, I need to ask you something. What do you need, Alex? Mum isn't in her room. Do you know where she went? Mum said she would go shopping and get more acquainted with the sissy. It's okay. Thank you. Okay, so, what should I do? Someone's in the kitchen. Oh, there she is. Excuse me, Mum, do you need some help? Can you go put some music on the radio? The environment is very quiet. Okay, we'll put on some music. We go collect your item box, backpack, and place it in your room. I'll do it right now, but first, music. I wonder if you've got good taste. What are you doing? Doing some washing up? Are you just scratching the plate with your hands or are you using a sponge? Anyways, and also, I'm oddly a bit taller than my mum. Maybe I should lay off the um, greens. Uh, looks like dinner will be ready soon. Woohoo! Food time! Anyways. Some classical music isn't bad. It's time to pack up my things. Do -de. Oh, I know the song. Do -de 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 -de. Very old tune. I'll put my box, my item boxes on the table. 
turn it off. Okay, I can't. I'll have to speak over the music. Why some blocks? Let's go. Okay, my some blocks will go here. Do do do. Lunch is ready. Come eat. Listen, guys. I think it's time to talk about moving. Again. Mux forced us to move for, from the city again. The city is quite beautiful. It has many buildings and things to offer us. It even might be easier for you to find a job, Alex. How old am I? I don't know if I'm if I'm ready to enter the world of work. Even so, I'll be able to provide more income in, to the household. If I can go to private school. Mom, I wanted to stay in the other city. I must have my grandparents so much. Don't worry, Eleanor. We'll go visit them from time to time. I know that the change was very dr drastic, but that doesn't mean we will not visit them again. We have to finish lunch. We haven't settled properly in the apartment yet. Yikes. I did say anything. It must be hard trying to keep in contact with friends, maybe relatives relationships. Lunch is delicious. Before I go out to the room, I'm going to turn off the radio. Yep, let's turn off that racket. I'm joking, it's not a racket. Let's go to my room and tidy up before I... I'm joking, it's not a racket. Very beautiful tune, just worried of copyright. <laughs> After we finish packing up all our stuff and settle into our respective rooms. Maybe cooks us a delicious dinner. We talked to... More clearly about the future plans again. But the future plans could be we're moving. <laughs> he repeats to us again that this world would be our new home from now on. And we finally agreed that tomorrow we would introduce ourselves to the neighbours. Well, best make friends, huh? Oh. The moon has faded away. <laughs> August 25th. Today is the day we agree to meet our new neighbours. We're done with the move. It's one less weight of us as these last few days. And there's watching TV. My mum should be waiting for us outside the apartment. What is my sister watching? <laughs> Let's go tell another that we are going to meet our neighbours. Let's do this. And I'm going to write up what that will happen. We haven't had any neighbours. Any talks with the neighbours. Also, I've noticed that the traffic is much less than it was we got here. Well, you've only just moved in. Let's talk to them and turn off the TV. Right, radio first. Boy, well, this is a specific order. Right, let's talk to Eleanor. Ella, we have to meet our neighbours. Mum is waiting for us outside. I'm going to turn off the TV, so go with Mum. It's a pop. Now to turn off the TV and radio and leave the apartment. Right. Is there a radio? There we go. At a point at a specific spot. Now radio. Now I can leave the apartment. And go greet some neighbours and make some friends. Ooh. The Resident Evil door opening. <laughs> 3pm. Okay, let's make some friends. We're already in the corridor meeting new people. Makes me quite nervous. Me too, Alex. Don't be nervous. Maybe our neighbours are like Mia and Peter. They might even have a pet, pet like curly old pup. Have you be like that? So here we go. Or maybe they will be dickheads. <laughs> go to knock on the door. Mm. 
No answer. Maybe they're not home. Maybe not. Let's go to the other doors. Yep. Let's go on then. Me and uh, talking to a neighbour. I'll go to our next door neighbour. Who is this you're talking to? Knock on the door. Do 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 do. Fucking brat! What do you want? Oh my god, it's Mr. Nutcracker! If you're just here to mess around, get your fucking ass out of my sight! I have some very angry neighbour. It's best not to bother Alex. That's what Miss Susan told me. Miss the Butch is a mental, unstable war veteran and his wife recently died. No one said that is that attitude. I suppose it's better that we turn to the apartment. Yikes, that really scared the living out of me. Fucking hell. Jesus. You best stay away from him as well, sis. You don't know what he's capable of. I sent to the apartment. When we were about to enter the apartment, the neighbours appeared. That family is stra so too strange. They weren't very talkative and the atmosphere had become very tense and awkward. They had two little daughters who seemed to be following the same footsteps as their parents. After a silence that seemed to last forever, we said goodbye to them and went back to the apartment. Oh. That's strange, isn't it? Maybe some neighbours and they're a bit... Like NPCs, I suppose. 11 pm at night. After what happened in the hall, the day went too normally. Isn't that a good thing? We had dinner and went to bed. However, I can't sleep. If things are working normally, surely that's a good thing, not a bad thing. The weather was much colder than normal, so the windows are closed. It's quite late. I must sleep. You sure should. Maybe you should write in that diary of yours. Mom? Something strange just happened. While I was sleeping, my mum suddenly came into my room. She didn't even bother to look, knock. He just pulled up the blinds and made sh sure the windows were shut tight. And then she was looking at the darkness of the night for a while. And as she ends, Oh, okay. Digger to finish the text! Give me a chance, bro! 10 a.m. next day. Hmm. It's dawn. The truth is, I couldn't sleep well at all. What happened yesterday was quite strange, and I still can't get it out of my head. I'll go to the kitchen and make myself some breakfast. I'm pretty hungry. Hmm. Well, I wonder if mum was looking at the moon or something. Or maybe saw something strange from a window too. Oh. Is that the news? Mum was watching TV. He looks terrified. His dark circle slightly red betray 
that he did not sleep well. She's watching the news. Whose Janice looks the same or even worse than my own mum. Janice speaks about the, the consideration and concern about something I can't hear very well. Mum, what's going on? Mum completely ignored me, turned off the TV and went to the room. Went to the kitchen. Oi! I was talking to you! Mum! Let me go after her. I see my mum behaves so strangely. Kettle's boiled. Maybe she hadn't had her morning coffee. I'll ask her again what's going on. Nope, let's go. Mom. Mom holds a dis breakfast tray. Her tiredness and worry too too obvious. Hi Alex, breakfast breakfast is ready. What just three cups of coffee or tea? Mum falls to Ashley too much. Ella's gotten up and even seems to notice. What's Mum, what's going on? Even Mona Lisa looks a little bit concerned. <laughs> Later that evening, 9pm. Mm. A few hours ago, Mum left the apartment suddenly. She looks much more nervous and worried than she did in the morning. She said she was going to do some shopping and would be right back. But she never... But she didn't. This situation, wherever it is, is also affecting me. Well, Mum's behaving strangely. Of course it would. I'm going. I'm trying to be calm because I don't want to scare my little sister. I have to make her dinner and t tell her to sleep. I wonder what we're going to make. We're going to make something very nice. At least we're watching some cartoons. Is there a way we're going to see outside as to what's going on? Like, it's very dark outside, isn't it? There's no light. Alright, let's make her food. Okay. I don't know what we're having for dinner, but here we go. Well, it's time for dinner. I must tell Eleanor. Eleanor! After dinner, Eleanor... I take her to the, her room. And I asked about mum and I didn't know what to answer. Jesus Christ, I have no idea. Just go to sleep. There's no need to be like that, Alex. Jesus. I didn't mean to yell at her like that. Go back in and apologise. August 27th. But hearing screaming somewhere in the building. These are heartbreaking, fearful screams. Unbearable screams. I go to turn on the TV and drown out such terrifying sounds. Unless you're going to try and investigate, I don't know. <clears throat> Good evening everyone, my name is Clara Simons. Welcome to the CRJ News Channel, your trusted news channel. The issue is of the utmost importance. The moon has been missing for two days. Scientists and astronomers from every part of the world, com oh. governments d dictated use of best telescopes and equipment. Test go too fast, I can't read everything. Trying to find the moon or it's clear as to what might have happened. Each attempt has failed and has caused mass hy hysteria. 
This can bring too many consequences or to our daily lives. Please make sure to close all doors and windows. Bundle up because in the next few hours there will be a drastic drop in temperatures. So I shall turn off any source of lights that can attract attention from the streets. Oh. What the hell was that? That's a stranger trying to get in. Sofa, sofa. Entering. Man should prevent the intruder from entering the apartment. I need to protect Ellen by all means until mum arrives. If she ever does come home, I need to see her. She must be too scared. Can we turn off that fucking radio? So filthy a balcony. Be an object of something, but not what I'm thinking. Oh Jesus! Wow. Definitely a very interesting demo and I'll be very keen to seeing the full release. I had a lot of fun with this and I like the style, I like the atmosphere. It was definitely quite spooky. I liked the context of this. I liked how weird it got as it went along. That neighbour didn't scare the crap out of me. And a bit where you got to hurry to block that door to stop the intruder from getting in. My my. I wish that the text could have been a little bit slower because I was still trying to read it. It was just moving on to the next subject. And I was like, I'm trying to read. So if you guys have any game suggestions, we'll see you play. There is a link for that down in the description or leave them in the comments. Like, subscribe, comment down below what you think. And I'll see you for the next time.